When you're looking for a hard drive, it's always a difficult choice to choose whether you want capacity or whether you want speed. Um, normally, capacity would mean just a standard hard drive and speed would have mean a solid state drive. An uh, interesting alternative to that is this from Seagate. It's a hybrid drive. It's what they call a SSHD. It's basically a conventional um, 7200 RPM hard drive, which is your quickest um, commonly found hard drives. There are uh, 10,000 RPM ones, but they're very, very expensive. But then what's combined into it and actually built onto the physical thing is a small uh, 8 gig SSD. And in effect, what that gives you is it, it functions as a buffer. So all the programs you use frequently and like Windows startup files normally gets buffered in the SSD part of the hard drive, which results in much, much quicker, quicker startup times and more than anything else, uh, less latency when you click on a program. Um, for comparison, uh, normally if you, if you click on Microsoft Word, it, you, you wait for the hard drive for a fraction of a second to find it, then load it. Whereas if it's on a SSHD or on a SSD, it's instant that it starts loading the program. So for programs you use often or games you use often, this is an excellent option. If you're someone that, um, for example, opens up the same game every day and plays it for a bit, this drive will definitely make a huge difference to your performance of your computer. Um, at Easy Gamer, we actually use this as the base drive for all our gaming PCs simply because it's not too much more expensive than a standard hard drive. And in real world terms, you do get quite a bit of a performance leap. It's not quite up to SSD performance, but for the, um, the cached uh, programs, it's actually about two to three times as fast as a normal hard drive. So it is significant enough that you definitely will notice the difference. They are the, the only downside with them um, at this at this point. They're only available in one and two terabyte capacities. So if you're looking for huge storage, such as a four terabyte or a six terabyte drive, the normal hard drive is still the the main way to go. But as a boot drive, it's a very nice option because you can keep quite a, quite a bit of games, quite a bit of programs on here, and it automatically adapts to what you use frequently. So if you're playing one one game one week and a different game the next week, it'll take two or three times and it'll figure out, wait, we're using this game now, and it'll load that that into its SSD, and then from then on, your loading times will be much quicker in that game. So it's a very nice little setup. It, as, as I said, it's not quite an SSD, but it's a good compromise. And if, if you're looking for real serious performance, rather go for an SSD, but you are looking... And, and uh, quite a multiple in terms of price for the same capacity.